I'm Jennifer Ramsey with Montana Fish, Wildlife and Parks. I'm the wildlife veterinarian for our agency. And we're here at the Wildlife Lab in Bozeman. I work for the entire state and I'm based in Bozeman. So the hunters, the biologists and the wardens who are out in the field this time of year, kind of, they're kind of our eyes and ears out there because I can't be everywhere looking at everything. We get a lot of information this year from those folks who are out there this year busy um, and seeing lots of animals. And that helps us just kind of keep our finger on the pulse of what's going on. Um, as far as wildlife diseases and, and you know how common are certain things and collecting data and finding things that are unusual. The more knowledge we have, the better we're going to be able to deal with it in the future. So we got a little stuff. Oh, but here's an arterial worm. This one, I must have nicked it when I went through, but there are arterial worm right here. That artery a little more. Yeah, they're pretty little, but when you get a bunch of them in there, they clog that artery right up. Wildlife diseases is a pretty important part of, of what we do as, as an agency these days. And this time of year, we got a lot of hunters out in the field seeing a lot of different things that we can't see from our offices. So, um, you know, we're asking hunters, especially moose hunters, for heads of moose. Um, it's a voluntary program for them to submit these heads, and we're looking for arterial worm, which we're finding. Um, we're testing them for chronic wasting disease and getting a lot of genetic material and age material on these animals. Um, hunters are really important this time of year because we get calls from them on sick animals they're seeing while they're out in the field. Uh, we're getting calls about unusual things they're finding when they're field dressing their animals. And those are important things for us to know about because um, they could be an indication of a disease or a parasite um, and that's one way for us to track those things. So it's, it's helpful for us to get those phone calls and, and then we can work with the hunter um, to try to get a diagnosis.